Hey guys, this is Brian Sykes with AI Explore. Uh, I just wanted to show you that Google has changed search. Now we've seen what Bing has done with uh, the Bing Create and uh, where they've added ChatGPT into the mix, but now Google uh, has some interesting things happening in their lab section. So if you go to labs.google, you can see it here. This is the page that's going to pull it up. Uh, you can scroll down through here and join the wait list to make sure that you get signed up if you've got a Google account. And I'm going to show you what this opens up. I literally just typed in, draw an image of a pet wearing a hat and generative AI created these images. So this is inside of Google uh, through the search bar. Now I decided, okay, I want to take this another step because this is interesting, but it asked if you want to make a follow-up. So I clicked on ask a follow-up and I'm going to scroll down here a little bit. And I said, can you make the image photo quality? And it pops up these images, okay? I want to ask another follow-up. Can you make the pet a black schnauzer and make the hat a top hat also give the dog a tuxedo? And here we go. Okay, this is actually kind of cool because I'm able to have a conversation. I'm able to have a conversation with Google inside of the search in order to find the images that I'm looking for. But this is the cool thing is we're not stuck at this spot. So when you're here and you think, okay, this is interesting, what else can we do? I can actually click on the image and it pulls up the image and it's telling me the prompt that I used, a photo quality image of a black schnauzer wearing a top hat and tuxedo walking down the street in a city. So this is the prompt that Google used to create the image. Uh, I can export the image and they can show me other images that's similar to this, but I can actually come in here and click on edit. Edit opens up where I can actually see the image and I can make changes from this point. Okay, so I'll choose export and it chooses to download or put it to your Google Drive. So I'll click on download and there we go. I just dropped it in. Now, what else could we do with this? Photo quality image of a black schnauzer wearing a top hat and a tuxedo walking down a street in a city. Let's see in New York City. I wanna see how detailed this thing can go. Photo quality image of a black schnauzer in full color wearing a top hat and a neon colored tuxedo, walking down the street in New York City, generate images. And we're giving it just a second to do its magic. And there we go. Here we're getting some punches of color that are quite interesting. And in these images down below, it left the primary image black and white and added accents of neon color. Very interesting concept. So. This is a pretty cool tool. It's a fun way to play. And the neat thing about this is being able to kind of continuously evolve the prompt uh, as we saw from the beginning up here. Again, this is available. This is Google search changed <laughs> with the introduction of the AI labs of Google. Hey guys, thanks so much for joining me on AI Explore and taking a look at what Google's doing behind the scenes. So uh, hopefully you get a chance to try this out for yourself. Um, but also take a look at all the other things that I'm sharing on a daily basis on LinkedIn. Um, and I'll try to include more of these things on YouTube and then check me out at AIExplore.co where you can find all kinds of resources from books, workshops, and freebies. Take care.